What's her name? Levitka. She was Lithuanian. She was an ass model. She asked you what? Yeah, I'd like to hear a little story. All righty. So back in the day when I was a high roller. When were you ever high roller? Well, you know, I told you I fed the city breakfast every morning. Grits and eggs? Oh, something like that. Well, anyway, back in the day, I took this chick to Iceland. Iceland? Is that, is that where all the high rollers go? Iceland? Six hours from Kennedy. And the nightclub scene is, uh, you know, is intense. And I thought I'd take this chick to Iceland. What's her name? Levitka. She was Lithuanian. She was an ass model. She asked you what? You heard it. Hand models, right? Advertisement? Right. She was an ass model. She did just jeans and, uh, you know, magazines and shit. Anyway, it was uh, fashion week in New York, and uh, I took her to Iceland. Levitka, Lithuanian, ass model, Iceland. You took her to the ice. So what? Well, for 500 bucks, they'll take you on a dog sled ride on a glacier. Dog sled? Yeah. And you know the old saying, if you're not the lead dog, uh, you, the view never changes? Right. Otherwise, uh, you're always looking at the asshole of the dog in front of you. That'll be funny in a minute when I get to that part. It's funny now. <laughs> bed yet and we're tooling across this uh, glacier and I got this hangover that's creeping up the back of my neck and guess what I'm looking at you obviously you're staring at the the ass of the dog in front of you you got it so this dog out of nowhere just lifts its hind legs up and puts them in the you know the harness there and just takes a shit while he's running on his front paws so he's dumping and running all at the same time now that's multi-fucking tasking if you ask me get out of here did it hit you Shit always hits you, man. I didn't know it at the time, but it was profound. Profound? Yeah. Why, you lost me. Well, you know, uh, when I went to prison later on, which you called, uh, I had uh, trouble uh, going to the toilet, you know, a privacy thing. And I... Couldn't take a shit. I was scared shitless, literally. So you know what I thought of? You thought of the dog. That's right. I thought if that dog could do what it needed to do, so could I. Save my fucking life. Wow, that is profound. And you know, it's 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 people adapt. It's like it's like you and I, like today. We didn't know how the day was gonna start. Wrong. Wrong what? I knew exactly how it was gonna start. Yeah, but do you know how it's gonna end? I'm tired of talking to you, Garber. No, wait a minute. Call me when the money comes in. You got four minutes. I don't know what he looks like, but he sounds good. Fucking talk shit, what are you fucking doing? He's got a sexy voice, though, man. He beat my bitch in prison.